Hey everybody, the bang is back. Let's play Super Mario All-Stars Part 12. You guys all waited for it? And it's finally here. Super Mario Bros. 3 All-Star Style. Just like the original, only 16-bit. It's very fun to play Super Mario Bros. 3 non-ROM hacked anyway, for once. Played two ROM hacks of it, one of them I couldn't finish, and the other one I did finish, Ultimate Super Mario Bros. 3. Can't wait to try out Cube Root and Binary's Super Mario 9 Root 3, which actually continues from Cube Root of 3. Because Cube Root of 3, from what I saw, has no ending. Like, you don't get an ending through it. It just tells you to be continued, pretty much. Which means you might get an ending in 9th Root of 3, but only Binary can answer that. And does it? I don't know. It's not finished. You'll have to be patient for that as well. Oh, that's 1-1 one -one completed. In just over a minute. And yes, I'm gonna do every single level in this game. It's fun that way. It. Oh. Oh, come on. Fine, I'll just take the one up. I'll get my mushroom back. Bowling for Goombas for the win. It's always a fun time. Kano roll! Oh, guess I'm not getting five extra lives after all. Yeah, whatever. Let's go to one dash three. And you know what? I am not gonna get the whistle. Because I'm probably not gonna use it anyway. And I'll just tell you where you can get the whistle in case you actually do not know. But I will not actually get it myself. Buzz. Paragoombas. More Paragoombas. And the Boomerang Brother. Now to get the whistle, you have to hold down for a few seconds on this white block. And then run to the end as fast as you can. If you're fast, you will go behind this. And that's where you get the whistle, plain and simple. But I'm not going to do it. So we're going to do this all the way. Take a box, blah blah blah. Okay, that's good enough. One dash four. That's for the platforms. Compared to playing this on Ultimate SMB3, all of these levels are so easy. easy. Like, you think Super Mario Bros. 3 is hard, but when you play a ROM hack of this, you're thinking. You know, when you think about it, this game ain't so bad. I mean, sure, it was difficult, but it was not balls to the wall, break your ass off hard. Pretty much that kind of hard. And we all know that kind of hard. Everybody's played a game that was completely difficult. I know I have. I want to be the guy. I still have memories of it to this very day. Especially with me beating it. And what a great way to beat it too, like while you're dying. You can't come up with any other stuff than that. Mushroom. There we go. Let's see how that goes. And I don't. We're gonna go to the first fortress. Where you can get a second whistle. The reason why I am not getting the whistle is because I don't feel like warping and I need some spots in my inventory. To get the second whistle, you have to fly above this ceiling right here and then hit up when you get to the end. Is that the door? Alright, wait. The door! Oh. There we go. I don't need to wait for that stupid door. I'll fast forward my way through. 
Boom boom, it's gonna go boom boom. Ooh, an end card. Let's go. Remember, I'm not safe staying this entire game, so I gotta rely on my memory here. Of course, a mushroom over here. And a one up. Nope, that was wrong. Start over here, of course. And a mushroom. Ah, at least we know where that other one up is. 1 5, here we come. Slide! Quadruple kill. Let's do a bonus. Isn't that so peaceful and relaxing? Now you gotta fly up around here. Oops, too soon. There we go, I still get the one up. Fuck those coins. You don't need every single one. If you do, that's because you lose a lot of lives in this game. Now remember, I failed a couple times in Super Mario Bros. 1 and a couple more times in Super Mario Bros. 2. Will this be the Mario game I can do from beginning to end without dying? I guess you're gonna have to find out. I would love for me to do so. But who wouldn't want to do that? Get some coins. Because I deserve it. Aww. Oh, that one up gone away from me. Now I only got 12, but I'm still at the first world. Sure love for this to be a no-death run. And I'm gonna take risks, just in case. Just to prove I'm badass. There we go, I'll take out that hammer brother, get him out of the way. Hold on these blocks too. Now I need another item. That's a flower. Good enough for me. First castle. Oh, it's terrible! The king has been transformed! Please find the magic wand so we can change him back! Okay. I can do that. I always trust Mario. Oh. I was really trying to see if I can do a really good juggling combo. Remember, I said this would be a no death run. I didn't say it would be a no hit run. That's hard to do. Besides, I'm doing pretty good at this game. I play this game for a lot. And I mean a lot. Boss time. Hey Larry, how's it going? You don't mind if I kill you, do ya? You do? You got no choice. Tell your brothers and sister I'm coming for them too. And that's the first wand. Six more to go. Oh, that's best for that. Oh, thank heavens! I'm back to my old self again! Thank you so much! Here's a letter from the princess! That guy there almost reminds me from, like, Billy Mays from those OxyClean commercials. Greetings, if you see any ghosts, be careful! They will give chase if you turn away! I have enclosed a jewel that helps protect you, Princess Toadstool. Yeah, fuck the jewel. And I'm going to stop the video right here. And on the next part, we're gonna do World 2. See ya!